This is it, the bells are ringing. This is Piazza del Duomo. This is the Duomo of Florence, and this is Florence's Christmas tree. Where's the major Christmas tree in your town? Today, I'm gonna take you all around Florence, and we're gonna explore. I think it's gonna rain today. Look at this, breakfast, perfect breakfast, and uh, it came out well today. Mm. Perfect. <laughs> It's a special treat today because we're heading into the Oh look at this, some blue skies up there. We're heading into the center of town because I want to see the Christmas tree they put up here in the center of Florence. They lit it up the other night. It should be pretty cool. It's right next to the big historic Duomo. In the United States, it's always, what, the day after Thanksgiving. Here, a bit delayed. You have these in your city? All around Italy, you get these paintings preserved that are in the sides of buildings. They put glass over them. It's not looking good out that way, and that's the way towards the center and the Christmas tree. One quick stop first, another coffee. Okay, let's go. Overall rating, 7 out of 10 today at Dita Artigianale. It's my favorite coffee place in Florence, but today, something was off. Ambiance, 10 out of 10. Value, 10 out of 10. But the coffee mm, today, something just didn't taste right. The coffee tasted off, six out of 10. Okay, back on our original mission. We're just going over Ponte Vecchio into the true historic center of Florence. We're gonna see this tree. That's not the main tree. Where is the main tree in your town? Does your city put up a tree in its main square? Let me know down in the comments. Almost there. This is Via Caltaioli, and it's one of the main shopping streets in Florence, and it leads you right down to Piazza del Duomo, where the church is, where the Christmas tree is, and it may be lit up during the daytime. We're gonna find out. There it is, we have the Duomo, and we have the tree, the, the silver, the gold bulbs, the red bulbs, and the white lights. They're twinkling, it's lit up. That's the photo you want right there. You got your tree in the background, and you have the Duomo of Florence. They're everybody stopping here, grabbing their photo. What does everybody gravitate to in your town for the Christmas time photos? You see it? That's better there. Now there's another tree up on Piazzale Michelangelo, so I suggest you check that out if you're here in Florence for Christmas to, to see that tree too, because you also get this awesome view of Florence. This is the tree in Florence's living room, the main square of Florence, lit up. Let me just check. Lit up on the seventh, right before the 8th of December, which is a holiday here in Italy and in lots of places in Europe. It's beautiful. It's just it's so excited getting close to Christmas. You get all the lights up in any city you're at. I remember in Santa Barbara, the lights, the Christmas tree on State Street. In Portland, they had a right in the center of town. In Milan, in my early days in Italy, I remember in, in the Central Station, they'd have the tree right there. And today on my Facebook, they showed me the photo that I took there from 12 years ago. Bye bye Christmas tree, on to the next spot. Florence's oldest toy store. I need to get something. Okay, success. I didn't get gold, but I got some copper and a paintbrush and some silver it's for a project tomorrow. And just before heading home for lunch, I gotta go pay the water bill. I'm doing a lot of things this week because I leave next Wednesday for the United States. Look at this. This is San Lorenzo here on the south side of Florence. But when I get home, I'm gonna talk about Christmas decorations, so stick with me till the end of the video. Trees are everywhere in Florence, but that is a sad looking Christmas tree there. I don't know why they haven't lit up this tree. It's uh, uh, post office right over here. And this, uh, for, for a post office, it's an amazing post office. I'm gonna show you the inside of it. All right, water bill will have to wait, or I'll do it online later. That line was too long, but I hope you get an idea of how beautiful it was in there before they asked me to stop filming it. Look at this covered walkway here, so beautiful. Heading home now, and then we're gonna talk about Christmas decorations. What do you do? Much better. These e-bikes, formerly known as Mo bikes, are all around Florence. You can hop on them, and now they have the electric ones here in town, so you can zip around. When I don't have my city bike with me, in the center, I jump on one of these so I can get home quicker. What do you do? Do you decorate a home for Christmas time? Do you just go out to see the Christmas lights out in the city? 
here in Italy, I used to have my own artificial tree that I put up every year, and I don't know what happened to that. During some of my moves, I lost it. Last year from a local florist, I got a little real tree that I put up in my house with some lights and some little bulbs on it that was pretty cool. This year, nothing. Also because I'm traveling to the United States and because you get out and see things around the city is pretty beautiful. And so you don't really need all the decorations at your home. And hey, why not? What do you do? Drop some comments down below. What's your thoughts on Christmas decorations and all your all the Christmas trappings in the city? What does your city do? Let me know down in the comments below. Is there a big Christmas tree in your city and where do you go to see that? But that's the Christmas tree here in Florence and that's my tree for 2021.